Please tell us what happened to that woman could have easily happened to any one of us. They're urging people to always pay attention to their surroundings and be on the lookout for anyone or anything suspicious. It happened in a matter of seconds. A violent assault in broad daylight captured by security cameras. I couldn't process what was going on. Juliana Murillo of San Fernando had flowers, a gift, and coffee for her mom. They were about to celebrate mom's birthday when suddenly Juliana was pushed to the ground by a violent stranger who wanted her purse. My body just went into shock. I just kept saying, what are you doing? What are you doing? It gets me angry, it gets, it gets me scared. When Maria Murillo saw what her sister went through, she was thankful Juliana wasn't severely hurt. I honestly believe the flowers helped um, get in the way of her actually hitting the gate harder. Um, so yeah, she was bringing flowers over for my mom's birthday. It looks terrible, you know, it's sad that this happened. It's very traumatizing for the victim. Lieutenant Walter Dominguez of the San Fernando Police Department says the robbery happened on Monday, April 15th at 2.51 p.m. in the 200 block of Park Avenue. He says Juliana did the right thing by letting go of her purse. Don't fight for the property. It's replaceable. Your life is not replaceable. So my advice is don't fight for it. Let it go. This happened broad daylight. The Murillo sisters say they're going public to raise awareness. Just always be aware of your surroundings. I think like that's the biggest message we would want to get across. I'm a daughter, I'm a sister, I'm a friend, like I'm a loved one and I don't think no one, no loved one should go through this. It was unexpected and it's just traumatic. So scary. Now, unfortunately, the description of the suspect is quite vague. A male in his 30s. He fled the scene in a vehicle, and police are using license plate technology to try to identify him. If you know anything about this case, contact the San Fernando Police Department. Uh, so, I that, mean, a male in his 30s. Yeah, I mean, that could be know. anybody. Uh, so, yeah. how is she doing now? Well, she went to the doctor to get checked out. She's doing okay, obviously, emotionally, psychologically, it, it's still a problem. But on the bright side, you know, she's getting ready. She's going to get married um, and so she's getting ready for her bachelorette party and you know that day it was her mom's birthday so she they were mm. celebrating a lot to celebrate